I absolutely adore PEI. I'm, I, I am, I am your biggest fan. So I've been in PEI for a couple of days. It's been awesome. I love the place. It's, everyone's so friendly and chilled out and relaxed and the food's beautiful. So I couldn't be happier. It's an unbelievable backdrop for food. And we're going to have lobster many, many, many ways. We've got fried lobster, grilled lobster. We've got lobster baking in the ground, baking in the beach with corn. We've got chowder. We've got mussels. We've got clams. You know, I've had beautiful oysters and incredible mussels and fantastic lobsters. PEI potatoes, which I didn't expect, are these gorgeous little potatoes that just taste fabulous. So the, all the ingredients are fantastic. I've, I've tasted the beef. I haven't cooked with it uh, on stage yet, but I've, I've tasted it. The beef's brilliant too. It's just, there's so much beautiful food here. You know, when, when you come for a visit and you have an opportunity to participate in, in a festival like this, um, there's so much pride, so much love and passion for what is here and the people that live here have so much heart and hospitality and uh, you feel totally welcomed and it's been, it's been amazing, um, just absolutely amazing. Oh goodness, I think uh, at first really just blown away by the people, um, the presence of uh, the people here and, and the laid back vibe. Um, and the welcoming vibe, you know, being from the South, uh, I think we pride ourselves on being very friendly and welcoming to, to strangers and uh, I felt very comfortable the first visit here. It was just that feeling of almost being at home, but the, uh, the landscape um, between the, the rolling hills and the farmland and the Atlantic off in the ocean, uh, it's just a very special place. And if you look at the island, it's pristine. So what a, what a great environment to grow, to grow material, whether it be beef or whether it be produce. Uh, so I buy from the island every, every chance I get. I think that's a great Canadian story. You know, I think um, I was expecting great seafood here in PEI, but I wasn't necessarily expecting incredible beef and, you know, that you've got such beautiful pasture. It's this gorgeous green environment. And it, the potatoes have this earthiness to them because I guess the red soil. and um, It's just such a special place. A lot of these types of festivals go on in the States, and I think where this festival is probably uh, much stronger is the sense that there's such a drive driven off the island's ingredients, um, whether it's shellfish or whether it's beef or potatoes or what have you. Um, you know, the unique aspect to this island is that they are truly utilizing and celebrating the local ingredients rather than just throwing a food festival. Um, it's, it's a festival that focuses on, on the island itself. I never want to leave. I may never go back home. I may not go home. I may just, you know, build a little shack here on the beach and live here permanently. Somebody will hire me. I know how to cook for gosh sakes. That'll come in handy.